What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Today is the day. Oh yeah, by the way, my name is Nick. Ready to get back? Where is it? I am so excited today. We are finally going to the ultimate setup. So, if you don't know, uh, like I said, I'm upgrading everything right here. Uh, we're about to redo it. Wire manage, cable manage. Just, it's going to be amazing. Um, this was not my old setup. My old setup was just this monitor and old TV. But I got this monitor and this monitor recently. And I was just too lazy. Not lazy, too excited. I wanted to use them. So I just kind of temporarily wired them up. I was redoing all that. And uh, yeah, so <clears throat> I have a bunch of other stuff as well to manage. Like all that. That's so nasty. Uh, it's just a huge mess. Redoing it all. And you guys will watch it all. I got the T3i right there. Recording. Wow. There's a quick little preview of everything. Got war room. I got my staples. We got cleaners. I got my extra battery for my phone. Vacuum. We got a lot of stuff to do, guys. So, I want you guys to stay. Kind of stay right there. Um, I'm doing a couple like in between cuts to my phone, kind of off my individual item. And I don't know how I'm gonna skip this video to be multiple videos or just one big video. But um, here's part one, or a full video. Stay tuned, guys. Here is my computer. For anyone who has ever wondered what I use, I use a custom built machine I built about two years ago and still, um, you know, it hasn't, it's still future proof so far. Uh, it's running a Intel i7 4790K, I think? I don't know. I don't know the exact processor, but it's an i7 uh, capable of 4.5 gigahertz. Uh, it's at 3.5 right now. It has 16 gigabytes of RAM, which I want to upgrade to 32 gig. It has Corsair high performance fans throughout the whole thing. Uh, besides that one huge ass fan, uh, it has LED lighting. It is the EVGA GTX 560 Ti for my main graphics card, and this is a Radeon graphics card. I just threw in there just to test, and it actually worked to where I could run my three displays. So, I don't even have drivers installed for this card because I don't want to, you know, confuse the computer running two graphics cards. Uh, but this graphic card is working perfectly. Uh, and I just threw it in there. So, that surprised me. But, um, yeah. Everything's pretty good on it. I just cleaned the dust off of it. Um, everything's looking nice, nice. For two years of never cleaning it, um, that's what it looks like. <laughs> Alright, guys. Guys, this is a mess. Oh my god. Such a mess. Still have more to take down. We have all that to move out the way, so. Wish me luck. Alright guys, so we hit kind of our first, like, stopping point. Um, so basically here is my RCA to 3.5 jack. And I need basically an extender for this because these cables 
has to plug in the back of my stereo, go down, run all the way to that corner, and this little six foot thing won't do anything. So we're gonna go look at my shop for some extensions for these, and um, hopefully we can find them, because we, we used to have some, and now I have no clue where they at, so we're gonna go look for them. Guys, it works. I'm just testing it right now for my laptop. As you see, the little 3.5 adapter is going in, it's going down, um, connected to my couplers, and it plugged into my stereo system right there. Now is to rerun Ethernet cables. I got my dad's computer and you run the wire into the molding. Um, that's the main wire power, like Ethernet wire coming from our modem. So I need to run that up and I have some few extra cables I brought in so I can try to, you know, make a shorter cable because this one's way too fucking long. So I'll pull his computer out, swap the cable, and then we'll be all set. Alright guys, um, so hit another stop point, card is full for the camera, so I'm copying all those, it's going to be about 25 minutes to wait, uh, this camera's just chilling, about to put up the stand up here, and just see how those monitors look up here, uh, I kind of cleaned it the best I could, it's still not completely, it's like it's spotting and streaking, um, but I got the best I can, I mean it's the best for what I did, and I'm about to do some mounting for the power supply, so that's going to take a little while anyway. So, uh, while that waits, I can do that. So I'm going to clean those monitors, put them on the stand, just just to size them, see how it looks. And then I'm not going to really wire them, and then I'm going to do some wiring underneath uh, for Ethernet and uh, power supplies. Alright guys, triple monitor stand is up, three monitors is up, and I tell you, those are one of the most hardest fucking these things ever do. Very stressful. Look how I mounted my uh, boom arm for my mic. This is my base. I basically hammered it, wedged it onto this rail, and then put the top on it because I could not find a place to mount it. So that's kind of my temporary way to mount it for this setup. Another update. I don't think it's going anywhere now. Base of the whole thing, and it looks amazing. <laughs> I love it so much so far. Alrighty, people. We have officially finished the top part and it looks amazing. That is the top. And it's all done. So it's amazing. So now I'm gonna take the camera, put it right there, and we're gonna do all the wine up there. So let's get at it. LED strips on point. Damn. 16 feet right here, guys. LED strips. Holy hell. What's up, guys? Wait, this is 16 feet of LED strips under this desk. Holy crap, it is so bright. So bright. Look at this. Look at this. Holy shit. So bright. Amazon, $25. I'll put the link in the description, guys.